Wipe the confusion away. Understanding the phrase. Wipe. Hello dear learners. Today, we're diving deep into a simple yet multifaceted word in the English language. Wipe. This word might seem straightforward, but it can be used in various contexts. Stick with me, and by the end of this video, you'll know how to use wipe like a pro. At its core, wipe means to clean or remove something by rubbing its surface, usually with a cloth or a hand. It's a word we often associate with cleaning. For example, can you wipe the table for me? My glasses are dirty. I need to wipe them. While the primary meaning of wipe is to clean or remove something by rubbing, it's used in a variety of phrases and contexts. 1. Wipe off, to remove something from a surface. 2. Can you wipe off that chalk from the board? 3. Wipe away, often used when referring to tears or something on the face. 4. She wiped away her tears. 5. Wipe out. This can mean to destroy completely or to fall in a mishap, especially in sports. 6. The city was wiped out by the hurricane. 7. He wiped out on his skateboard. 8. Wipe clean, to clean something thoroughly. 9. Make sure to wipe clean the counters after cooking. 10. Wipe the slate clean. A metaphorical expression meaning to forget all past problems or mistakes and start again. 11. Let's put our differences aside and wipe the slate clean. 1. Wipe versus swipe. While both involve emotion, swipe often refers to a quick brush or movement, especially in the context of touchscreen devices. Wipe has a connotation of cleaning or removing something. 2. Correct. I wipe the dust off my desk. 3. Incorrect. I swipe the dust off my desk. Unless you did it really quickly without the intent to clean. 4. Wipe out versus wipe off. Remember, wipe out often means to destroy or fall, while wipe off refers to cleaning or removing something from a surface. 5. Wipe it. This phrase might sound strange if used inappropriately. Ensure the context makes it clear what it refers to. 6. Correct. There's a spill on the floor. Can you wipe it? 7. Ambiguous. Can you wipe it? Without any context, we don't know what it is. And there we have it. The word wipe is more versatile than one might initially think. We hope this video has wiped away any confusion you had about its usage. Remember to practice using it in different contexts to truly grasp its meaning. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.